Hey everyone. I <clears throat> went shopping today and I was going to make my own portfolio like Ella did, but um, I'm just not that handy. And so I went out to Michael's and I bought the biggest portfolio they had, used a 50% off coupon. So I ended up paying like $32 for this gigantic thing. I'm not even gonna be able to show you. But it's 23 inches by 32 inches by three inches. So it'll hold, here. It'll hold a 58.4 centimeter by 81.2 centimeter by 7.6 centimeters. So the, the largest painting I have other than my two blank canvases that I'm going to use for the heaven and earth designs. Um, the largest I have is like a 70 by 50 that's coming. So it should fit in here. I'm thinking that they'll have to just be rolled in the middle is how that would work because I don't see, I don't know. It, I don't know if it's just lengthwise or what, but it's got pocket, a Velcro pocket on the outside here. So I can fit smaller canvases in there if I need to. And it's got on the inside, see if I can open it a little bit here. It's got this, these type of pockets. It's got one on that side and the other side it's like got a sleeve to stick big things oh that's what both of these are they're like sleeves they go all the way through so I'm hoping that um, fixes my storage issue now that's the big item it's not the most important though I and I'll get to that last I went to Dollar Tree and I wanted to have four of each of these adhesive diamond wrap since I did like them. Um, not necessarily for one for each one. I mean, some of them may take more than one. That's why I, I did get, I already had one of each color, but they only had one silver, but I was able to get three more gold three more of this bluish color, three. I actually picked up four of the pink since I used one today. So I have four. And then here's my original colors that I had with the partial pink that's left over. So I didn't buy them out. They still have some left, but somebody obviously liked the silver because those were all gone. I'm kind of trying to get to the final point quickly because it's a surprise for my daughter, my older daughter that lives with us. Anyway, um, I also got some of this stuff was on clearance, but this one wasn't. I thought this was so cute. I have a minion painting coming and I think this would look good as a border. It'd be a lot of minion, but I, I still think it would be adorable. Um, and then I got this one. I really like these designs. I don't know what I'd use it on yet, but this one was on clearance. So I figured that would be good for something someday. I need, I need a storage area. But this was on sale for $2.99, so that was awesome. And I got this one because it kind of looks like a wood grain. Well, it is a wood grain look. That would be good for like a wood frame look. So I thought that was pretty neat to get that. And then I got this little one. They were um, on sale. Let's see. This one. It said that they were on sale for $1.99. But let's see. That just shows all my discounts. Um, okay, yeah, here we wood grain, skulls, teal, pink giraffe. Is this the teal? Yeah. 
to $2.99 is a normal color, normal price. And it says $2.54. I had a 15% discount off because of my membership card or whatever. So it wasn't um, the price I thought it was. I thought it was supposed to be like $1.99. But I thought that was really pretty. And it is duct tape, so it could be used on something that needed a small border. I don't know if you can see it very well, but it's really pretty, sparkly, beautiful. Now, the last thing I got, I'm, oh wait, I got this at the Dollar Tree too. It's washi tape. Isn't that cute for a buck? I mean, I think that's a little expensive because I don't spend that much on washi tape normally, but I couldn't pass it up. <laughs> okay, so this last thing, um, I have a couple of these, but I'm going to do this next, and there's a reason for that. Um, we have these cats. We have three cats. My daughter has two of them. She's 24 living with us while she goes to school. Um, we have a black one that looks just like this. And then her sister, they came from the same litter, which was ones that one of our cats had. And so those two cats are my daughter's. And then this one, Shadow, she had um, two different litters in this house we were living in and out of those two litters only one cat survived and that's my cat her name's precious so all three of the cats are related well my daughter was doing finals yesterday and uh, she came home pretty late I was putting Tesla into bed and all of a sudden, I I just heard her screaming, and she was just screaming and screaming, and I thought she hurt herself really bad. So I come running to the other side of the room, and, and she was at the bathroom door, and I'm like, oh, God, no. And I looked in there, and Shadow was laying on the floor. She was gone. And she, it was devastating. It was it was just shocking because we didn't, she didn't act like she was in pain. She didn't, because we've had a couple of cats that have died and they've always done this really horrible meow when they were passing and it was just getting ready to go. And they, she didn't do any of that. She didn't make any noise. I think she just laid down, went to sleep and never woke up. And so I want to make this for her. It's really special so that she can have something just to keep close to her. Um, so I was going to start my Heaven and Earth designs next, but um, I'm going to do this one really quick to give to her. And I'm sure you'll understand that it's, if that hadn't happened, I would be doing that right now. I would be doing the Heaven and Earth design. I'd be starting on that, but. I really think it's important that I get this done for her. And I'm sorry it's such a sad story, but that's how um, we've been going through since last night when we found out. And she's been dealing with um, calling around so she can get, get her, she's going to have her cremated and keep the, a little urn for her. I mean, she was 16. The cat was 16. So my daughter's 24. She had her since she was eight years old. And it, it was just a really, really hard, hard thing for us. Her especially. But it was hard for me too. But I'm not, you know, the one that... It, it, she didn't belong to me. And my heart wasn't with her like my daughter daughter's heart was I mean I I cried and I covered her and I I'm sad and but I can be strong for her and do this for her and hope she likes it so that's what 
I'm going to do. I don't know if I will start the drill with me on this one, but um, I think I'm going to go ahead and start it tonight. I haven't done any diamond painting at all today. I did the framing, and then we went to the store, and I got this, this stuff that I just showed you, and then um, I came home and did the unboxing, and the... I. I organized all the beads and put them into zip ziploc baggies so that I can set it to the side since I'm missing stuff and I'm not gonna be able to do it anytime soon. I found two colors that had that really oily, icky beads that I I just I don't want to mess with it right now. So I just marked on the bags that they're oily, so I know to expect that when I go to start this, I can clean them and take care of it. And I just finished that and. It's now, what, uh, eight, almost nine o'clock at night. So, um, I need to relax now and do this. And that's about it. Uh, I just wanted to let you guys know what I'm going to be working on because I know I did say that I was going to start on that. And I, I don't want to disappoint anyone, but it's important. And... I'm sure I will probably have something up again tomorrow, but for now I'm going to just kick back and listen to my book. After I get Tesla to, to bed, she's in the bathtub right now. It's, she doesn't have school tomorrow. Today was her last day of school, so uh, she gets to stay up a little late on non-school nights, but she has a summer program she'll be going to for six weeks, but she has three weeks off before that happens. So in the meantime, I will um, let you guys go. You have fun doing your diamond paintings, and I will have fun doing mine. Even though it's for a sad occasion, it's still happy. It makes me happy doing these, especially when it's for somebody else. All right. Thank you for your understanding. I'll talk to you later. Bye.